What's up guys and welcome back, we're here with another Rome 2 battle for you. This was sent in by two, uh, well, two guys that played the battle. Um, thank you very much for sending it in. Um, it was an excellent battle between Parthia and the Ariadai. As you can see here, Parthia with their camels. Look at the camels ready for war, camel cataphracts. They are going to mow down some Ariadai, I'm sure of it. So anyway, we will get underway with the battle while we look at the army comps. Um, Basically, as you can see, our camel cataphracts, as we've already gone over. Mercery Sarmatian horse archers. We also have hillmen, Parthian swordsmen, Parthian foot. Um, the general is royal cataphracts, and we have a lot of eastern spearmen and hillmen in the front, it would seem. And some Persian hot plates, of course. Um, we'll quickly have a look at what Ariadai Arid, has got. I'm probably butchering that name. Um, they've got Illyrian marines, mercenary Tarantine cavalry to counter those. Uh, Sarmatian horse archers, I presume. Um, Illyrian cavalry, thorough spears. Um, the noble hot plates, of course, and a lot of uh, a lot of cavalry. To be fair, he's trying to con combat it, but he's only bringing medium to their heavy. Well, super heavy, not even not even very heavy, super heavy. And he's also brought mercenary Celtic warriors. Excellent. So, um, yeah, let's get this battle underway. As you can see, um, Parthia is doing its typical thing of sending forward some uh, horse archers to skirmish out and uh, just do a few little damaging uh, forays. Killing one guy here. Poor... Oh, no, two guys now. Oh, poor buggers. They're not even going to see battle and they've just been shot in the face with an arrow. Well, what a poor way to go. And over on this side, as you can see, there's a lot of movements going on. Um... And it's Mercy Tarantine Cavalry now firing back. Excellent. And getting a few kills. Good to see. Well in Ariadai. That's what we like to see. As you can see, uh, the balance power is well in favor of um, the Ariadai um, at the start of this battle. Probably because Parthia obviously brings a lot of um, cavalry. And it's also not got the strongest infantry compared to um, Ariadai's like heavy uh, noble hoplites. Those are the ones that I'm thinking of. They'll really be putting the balance power in their favor. And no wonder they are extremely um, powerful. Let's look at these. Let's have a look at these guys. Oof. They look like they're going to do some damage. They look excellent. And the cavalry in the back, excellent. This game, even for its age, still looks great in my opinion. Still looks great. And here we go. The battle, uh, the armies are now shaping up um, and responding to each other's moves. Looks like the Tarantine cavalry might be going in for a a cheeky attack here, maybe? I thought they might have gone for a charge for some reason, but no. And the Sarmatians get shot off on them and do a little bit of damage. I think they get a few guys. And then on this side, the infantry looks like it's about to crash. So we're going to get the first uh, clash of infantry. No, no, Ari dies running away. It, could it be like this all game? Could there be no uh, charges? No, here we go. This is going to be a good charge from the, from the camels! Oh, they never stood a chance. The camels, man. Look at all those guys. I mean, most of them will get up, but I mean, the camels did so much damage. But it's also broken the formation, so the hillman can just go straight in and do a lot of damage. So Parthi did very, very well there um, in his tactics of just smashing in and then sending in infantry after into a, a dysfunctional formation. So, I mean, he's done the same here. The Celtic warriors are going to have the same fate put on them. Poor, poor camels are getting sacrificed to uh, for that. Oh, little jewel over there. Oh, he's cut his head off. Oh, very nice. Um, basically, now, yeah, along the entire, most of the line, there is now infantry clashes. Parthian swordsmen, some of their better infantry still losing massively. I mean, it's to noble hot plates, so no wonder. Hillman here getting chased back. Um, these, noble, these noble hot plates have taken a load of damage. Actually, no, this can't be them, surely. Oh, no, that's Hillman. They're all Hillman that have died. But, I mean, it's still very much in favour of the Aridite. And there's already breaking for Parthia. No surprise. I mean, their infantry is just of no... It's not even good quality. It's terrible. They rely, they rely on horse archers and heavy cavalry, if you don't know from history. That's how they beat the Romans and everyone else so many times. Oof. Some nasty little volleys coming in there with uh, Javis. And now, yeah, they've broken... That's it. That's that's basically this flank already wrapped up. Parthia it looks like it's in for a ass weapon, basically. I mean, there is no way, surely, that they can... 
they can hold on to this. They're already, like, outmaneuvered. I mean, they're breaking cavalry. All the mercy returning to cavalry. The camel cataphracts are coming in for another charge. Excellent. Love to see it. Come on, camels. I'm, I'm rooting for you. Just because you're camels and you're just such a strange creature to be at war. <sighs> they look so silly in all their armor. They'll kill. Oh, yep, they've just killed those Celtic warriors. I mean, they're now getting focused down by uh, all these Javis. Get out of there, camels. It's huge breaking. Oh, noble uh, hoplites breaking now to Persian hoplites. That is a turn up for the books. They're shaking. General recently died. Oh, I didn't even see that. The uh, Aradai general has died. That was an assassination and a half. Well done, Parthia. That may help him... Um, and give him a chance in this battle because I mean before I mean it looked like Parthia was in a really sticky position but now morale is going to be low oh that's another devastating charge surely not none of them are getting up just stay down dead be dead no you fools those camels will massacre you smart move smart move lads run away yeah the camels now are basically I mean Aridai looked like it saw this flank out but it now it's lost this flank and now it's relying on its left and sends its left is very strong. Lots of infantry here. They need to swing in behind like they're doing now. Swing in behind, break these infantry nice and quick. And then they can try and focus on taking down this cavalry. Um, he's also not, I've realized, brought no inf like skirmisher infantry. Interesting move by him. I mean, they would be quite handy to deal with horse archers because they're a lot more accurate and there's a lot more of them to uh, focus on the horse archers. Yes, they're less mobile, but if he beats, wins the infantry battle, then he could just start shooting from afar himself. Eastern Cataphracts doing what they can to hold on. It looks pretty dire still for um, Parthia. I mean, there's a lot of infantry left that they've got to break. And they've only got cavalry and uh, archers. And all their infantry is spears, so it's going to be a problem for cavalry. I mean that's a that's a fairly good sandwich charge there by the by camels and horses combined. Oh no, is that just all camels? No, there are horses in there. It's a a mul oh that was a lot of friendly fire there though. There's a multi uh I wanna say cultural but that's not right. A multi animal sandwich. That was a terrible terrible line but we'll get we're gonna have to stick with it. Um yeah Persia's bait Persia Parthia has basically lost all of its uh, infantry. It's because these guys are called Persian hotplates. I just want to call them Persia. Which is what they basically are. Parthia. What are these Persian hotplates going to do? Parthia are in a real, real sticky position. I mean, there's not much left. Oh, uh, the balance of power is shot in um, Parthia's favour, actually. Now I look at it. That is... Oh, yeah, because everything's just breaking now for Ariodai. Because... Their general is gone, and I mean, they're just getting skirmished down. Look at all these poor guys just getting shot. All these guys here, and now they're just getting shot slowly by all these horse archers. Poor, poor sight. And the foot archers doing a similar damage. These Celtic warriors just not going to be, I mean, they're not going to be able to do it. They're just, they're light infantry. They probably break to archers at this point. And these noble heavy spears, are what's left? Thoros spears left as well. Is this going to be a charge by the cavalry? No, no. They're just going to fire some more shots. Typical path here, hey? Yep, and just like that, that's ended. They all broke. Wow, that was a huge turn around. Well, anyway, we'll end the replay and we'll look at the end results quickly. So thank you very much to uh, Graham. I presume that's Bubblefish. I'm not sure. And then ha and Hamilcar uh, Barker for sending this in um, and, and allowing me to use it. Um, much appreciated. It was a really good battle. Um, and I'm surprised that Parthia won it, to be honest. I thought Aridai at one point had it in the bag with the huge amount of infantry they had. Um, but, I mean, yeah, look at these these kills. I mean, the camels. The camels are doing so well. 243 and then 166. I mean, just, you got, can't fear. I mean, you've got to fear the, um, the camels. I mean, also don't fear them because they're stupid animals. But, I mean, if, if they're running at you, I'd be scared. Eastern Cataphracts also doing very well. I mean, the general unit being looked after quite well, but this one, basically dead. But I mean, it's got so many kills. 300, basically 300 itself. 
Um, horse archers, not getting many kills, but doing their job of harassing people. Archers, again, sit, same with them. Um, and then the infantry obviously was not going to do well. It was just going to get eaten up by theirs. I mean, look at their infantry, hundreds. They're, they did very well, to be fair, some of their infantry. Their Illyrian marines are actually fairly okay. They did okay, yeah. I mean, they could have done with bringing some archers, I think, just to try and combat, like, Parthia's archers, or maybe his horse archers, but they may have just got ro ridden down by, like, cataphracts. Who knows? You just don't know. Um, but yeah, it was a very good battle, guys. I hope you enjoyed as well. Um, if you did, please leave a like and subscribe for more. And until next time, bye for now.